it gets much easier to repurpose content. So for example, we are currently live on YouTube, LinkedIn, Twitter, and a couple of different Facebook accounts and Twitch as well. Welcome. We didn't used to go live on Twitch, but we are live on Twitch now. Um, and so what that allows me to do is, first of all, I can speak one to many. So we can speak to people on all sorts of different platforms that we couldn't do in the past, right? That's pretty amazing. First of all, I think that's amazing. The second thing it allows us to do is we can now pull out the MP3, the audio from this podcast, and we can create four different podcasts because now we've got four part series on, you know, so for example, if you're looking at a podcast and there's a 40 minute podcast, you're like, oh my God, I don't want to listen to 40 minutes. But you see the bit, it says, why everyone should have a podcast show, number one wider audience. You go, yeah, I want to listen to uh, people consume content differently, number two. What's that one? I want to listen to that one. They can go into that one specifically. So we're repurposing a longer form piece of content into shorter form pieces of content so that people can delve directly into that very specific piece of content. So they can consume just that one. And then they might look at a different podcast that's talking about property and just go, deeply into that piece of content. And so we might have a 20, 30, 40 minute piece of content that we then break down into shorter pieces, uh, both uh, visually and aud auditorily, uh, audio wise, I think I'm just making words up now. Um, but that works really, really well for us. Uh, and it helps our clients or our customers or our audience um, just delve into bits that they want to listen to. They might not want to listen to Dan going live 20, 30 minutes every single day. They just can't fit it into their day or they've got no interest. But they might want to listen to this, this bit of content about repurposing. And so that's what we do. If you look at our YouTube channel, uh, we have little shorter bits of content and longer pieces of content. So if you want to just listen to a longer piece of content, you can do. If you want to get the shorter pieces of content, you can do that as well. If you then just want to go to iTunes and just listen to the shorter pieces of content, then you can do that as well. And so we repurpose these content pieces. And then the other thing that we actually need to do, and we just started it over the weekend, was, you know, we did a podcast uh, called How We Drop 50,000 Leaflets for Free. Podcast number three it was. We have just repurposed that piece of content that I recorded eight, eight years ago. And we just drove, I think, 55 people back to the website to listen to that one single piece of content. So a piece of content I did eight years ago got me 55 views on Saturday or Sunday or whatever, whatever day it was. And so now it's like, okay, let's go through all the rest of the pieces of content and let's create more pages. Let's get the best of the podcast, the ones that people have liked, the ones that people have commented on the most or we've got feedback on the most or that people have listened to the most and let's put them back out there as long as they're still timely. And so we can do that. We can take a piece of content pre-Brexit, talks about all the bad things that are going to happen. Now that we're after Brexit, we can see what came true. Are people going to listen to that? Are people going to get value from that? Absolutely. And so we can repurpose this content. And that's exactly um, what you should be doing with your content as well. So look, I hope that's useful for you. Let me know if it is. And um, can I get rid of that piece of content there? Yeah. Perfect. Uh, look, I hope that's useful for you. Uh, if so, let me know. Just drop me a like or give me a bit of feedback. I like those. And we'll speak to you on the next video. My name's Dan Latter. Have yourselves a wicked day.